hi everybody. I just wanted to come on and let you see um, Yvonne and I had agreed before Christmas time well, to do a sort of swap and um, what it was was I'd seen Yvonne make such a design her own little um, tags and postcards and things like this um, and I'd asked her if she would mind sending me some or uh, asked her how she made them and what she did so she said very kindly that she wouldn't send me some of her designs and they really are gorgeous. I just love how she's done this. And I've got little hands here today as well. Um, so this is the first one. I'm wondering if I can put it on the back of there. And they are so, I think these are just great for putting in mini albums and things. And I love this one with the colours and they're just really, really pretty bows and flowers and things. And then the postcard in the background. So give me a few of those. And this is really cute as well. Lovely flowers in the corner and then the script. So paper. With all my heart, a few of those as well, and then there's a couple of this ones. These are really nice. This ones I think I'd seen her, and uh, she's very, she's got flowers in the corner, and then it's the cart post style, is it? From there, and they're lovely. And there's that design, and then this design she's done as well. So these are really lovely ones. I like how you've done these, and uh, thank you very much for sending me some because I'll be able to use them in some of my albums as well. So she sent me those ones and then these are some that she's printed off from Pinterest for me. And I love what they follow on your channel, Yvonne, because you've got lots of nice stuff on your Pinterest. So I like to keep an eye on what you, what you find as well because it's great for ideas. So these are, and I still have little hands here wanting to get in the video, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then this is a little tag and it's got studio photography. Some more tags. Another one. Another one. A lovely postcard one. And then that's a lovely one as well for using in an album. And it's got the stamp in the corner, that one looks great. And I like this one. I like the idea of the wine glass. Yes, yum. And it's got the script and it's like a later book in the background of it, so it's really, really nice. So thank you for those you want. I think I'm going to have to have a nose about and print some off as well. It's a great idea. So she sort of sent me those. And then in the... Not only did she send me them, but she sent me some... Um, a pack of the Fujifilm uh, photo paper. So she sent me this as well. And then she's put on this, have fun printing out some photos. Hugs Yvonne. And I thought, oh, that's pretty nice for her. And then as I went further in, I discovered that she has actually made me one of her own handmade albums. And this, I was actually, I was really, really, whew, so chuffed to see this because I, I love watching your, your albums and things that you make your own and you make a really good job of them. And then this one's been personalised and it smiles with the Swansons. And I thought that was so sweet and it's got flowers at the top and this lovely script stamp. You've made sort of banners coming down with that and a doily. And then it's like a punched, um, paper punched uh, edge in the back here. And then there's ribbon that goes all the way around. And I love the lilac purple colour. It's just one of my favourites. So then I was like, ooh, so I opened it up. And this I thought was just stunning. Bruce, please. And what she's done is um, she's made a pocket on the inside and it's got remembering stamped in here. And then these are little photo marks she's put in. And... <laughs> I've got the punch I want, um, Yvonne, but I can't get this anymore. A friend of mine is a stamping up demonstrator and she can't get this stamp, this punch anymore. And I hope EK Success decide to take it out and sell. But I do have some punched images. She, my friend kindly went and hand punched a wad to me, so I've got some to keep me going. But I would really love to get that punch. And she gave me that size and then this bigger size. So there's four of those as well again. And it's all colour coordinating and everything. It's super... And I thought this was a really good idea and I was like, oh wow. So not only that, but then this side I discovered then I thought, oh, it must be pages here. But this actually goes out from in here and it's like one of that false books that she's made in here. And I thought this was really clever and a really nice gift. And then there's a belly band that she's made, lovely release. And then ribbon and things on it there and one of our little flowers. Bruce, please put that down. I've got my little one here trying to get involved. And then... Um, purple ribbon around it as well and you take this all and then this all opens out like an accordion style and I thought this was just absolutely gorgeous 
So my love, she's got all the journal and spots that she's obviously um, die cut and put them on every other page. And there's lovely paper in here as well. And then you turn it around on this side as well. So, and that was how it looks. So thank you ever so much Yvonne, because I'm going to have great fun printing out some of the photos on the photo paper you sent me. And filling this up with some smiles from the Swansons as you put it. Oh, that was a great idea and I was really, really touched that you made it, especially for us. And um, I thought it was great. So we've got that one there. And then she also sent me... Sorry, I got interrupted there. Um, she also sent me this. I love all your tissue paper, on. It's great. I just love it. It's really bony colours. Bruce, what are you doing? Be quiet, please. Um, she sent me a lovely bag of goodies. Um, I'll go through this first. She sent me cute little goodies. I put them in for to eat. No, not the ones to eat. Goodies and craft goodies, Bruce. <laughs> so I've got a lovely um, black butterfly. And then this... Um, what do you got? The name of them has escaped me. But um, it's got sister on that one. And this is, I love these, you these are so, um, they're like the iron-on appliques, but they're the appliques things, and this is a lovely purple angel. And then a bigger pink one, they're just stunning, they're really boring. And then this one that says, hmm, so I love them. Some teardrop trim, and this stuff is so soft, and it is gorgeous. I love this, Yvonne. Thank you so much. Because it's just, I mean, you can cut that off and use the use bits on their own, or, sorry, can you see these? Aren't they stunning? And the teardrop pearl, and then some beautiful. Oh wow, it's wide, wide lace. I haven't undone this yet. Even. It's really wide, lovely lace there as well. So thank you ever so much. I don't have any of that kind of stuff. And then the goodies she sent me. I could really do with a tub. What I'll do is I'll tip them out here and I'll rummage them. So there's some of these oh, grief wooden beads that she sent me. Which are lovely. So there's these wooden beads. Thank you. And um, I love these. These are so cool. I think they'll be really cool using these as closures on albums or something along that lines. So there's a lovely blue coloured one and it's got all these tiny like seed beads on it as well. And then it's it's like a phone, a phone sort of charm. You could use it on your phone as well, I suppose, but I'm going to use that on an album. So I've got one of them blue and black. So I wonder, do you make these, Yvonne? You know, you need to let me know, because they are... I love that. That's really pretty. So two then. Some really, really long... Um, oh, what do you call Paper fasteners? So some of those. A nice clip as well. These are always handy on albums and things. Thank you for that, Yvonne. And I love this button. That is really, really, really cool. Like that one, and then this is like a wine glass charm, and uh, that's really pretty as well. So I'll be able to use that. And I love these teardrops beads. They're nice and stick pens as well, and a lovely chunky blue. I love the colour of that one. It's really pretty. And it's got the bit on it, but I can always take that off if I want to, or use it as it is. And then some more bling. Wooden beads, which would be lovely. Oh, yeah, so she sent me so much stuff, thank you so much. Yvonne. These are so nice and lightly. Look at that. Oh, wow. Look at the size of those ones. I really like these, they're really nice. And there's more wooden beads, some pearls, a bit of bling. And oh, what's this one? Oh, it's like the little rabbit out of Alice in Wonderland. A teapot, tea time. I'll show you them in a minute, okay? And then I love these. I think I can't show them. Go the acrylic roses. These are really pretty. It's one thing I would like to do this year at some point is make some of these for the moulds. This little bale. You like this bale, Bruce? You like your jingly bales? A butterfly and a key chain as well. So this is all the lovely yumminess she sent me and uh, I will definitely be able to use these this is the I like to make these I keep thinking about buying some of them moles to make my own so thank you ever so much Yvonne and I really enjoyed doing this swap so thanks Ames for hosting this one and uh, 
I hope that you have many more. And I will join in with some more once I get a bit more time because I'm quite busy just now. So I will uh, try and get this one uploaded like a save one. I have tried recording these a few times now and for some reason it wasn't working. So fingers crossed this will be up to me and you will know that I have the things and I really, really love them. Thank you for all that goodies and the lace and all this that's here and I was just so chuffed that you made this for us. I think it's lovely so I will make use of this and fill it up with some photos. Um, we've got some more photos from our holiday to the States so I think I will put some of those in here as well and I've got plenty of paper to do it with so thank you ever so much again and uh, thanks for watching and we'll speak soon. Bye!